The purpose of this video presentation is to help you to better understand the problems with ballast, water contamination, top water flow products, and how our products can stop the contamination and make the de-ballasted water safe. IMO have a new guideline regulation that should be set in force by the end of 2016 or beginning of 2017, making sure all ships are de-ballasting the ballast water with the right treatment according to IMO guidelines to prevent cross-water contamination. With good reason. Every year, around 5 billion tonnes of ballast water travel across international borders, carrying species like plants, fish, viruses and bacteria. Only a few species survive the temperature, food access and sanitation. And these species are the very hardy species that have the potential to cause major harm in our oceans. Our research has enabled us to provide cost-efficient and adaptable systems for treating ballast water. Our products have been thoroughly stress-tested over several years, making sure that they will be ready for the market demands. In fact, we started making our first prototype back in 1998. Let's take a short look at why our products are so cost-efficient and reliable. Robust designs, high efficiency, low maintenance, corrosion-free materials, chemical-free, stress-tested over several years, minimal cost over life cycle. We have talked to Yad Muawad to hear what he has to say about the problem and our systems. Uh, the challenge of ballast water treatment on board ships is, is its operational aspect. Uh, the crew of the ship must, uh, must operate the system correctly, they have to learn how to do it. Uh, you have a lot of contamination on board ships because ships are not built to treat ballast water, they are built to trade cargo. Uh, all of those problems that eventually will occur with traditional treatment equipment installed on board ships can actually be nicely overcome by uh, technologies that are external to the, uh, to the ship. Uh, those could be a good uh, supplement and a replacement to traditional uh, treatment of ballast water on board ships. Uh, you can have them as, as equipment on, uh, for the ports, as a backup equipment in case the equipment on board the ship does not work, you have a place to deliver your water. Uh, the solution that uh, Top Water Flow is using uh, with filtration and UV is a, is, a, is a traditional treatment of ballast water that has been proven for many years now that it works. It's uh, solid, it's, uh, it's, uh, it's well tested. The, uh, the fact that you have a treatment system independent of whatever the ship is doing, especially when it comes to energy, gives the equipment a potential to uh, perform at a much better standard than what the IMO today is requiring and, and uh, that in itself is, is, a, is, a, good, uh, is a good feature of, of, of such equipment. Top Water Flow has a range of treatment systems such as filter systems, UV water treatment systems, land treatment systems both mobile and permanent as well as external treatment by supply boat. In addition, we are also developing a facility solution that can use the remaining organic waste of the water treatment to make compost. The external ballast water treatment barge. Top Water Flow has made an external boat that can connect to the side of the deballasting ship and start a treatment process offshore. The water will run through our supply barge with a mounted treatment system, which will have higher capacity than the onboard deballasting systems. With an external treatment system, the ship can deballast its water without any concerns, problems or unforeseen expenses. In this case, there is no need for any investments to be made in onboard treatment systems. With the use of external systems, the ship owners don't have to worry about the quality of the deballasting water that may contain excess of pollutants, hazardous chemicals and radioactive decay. Furthermore, the ship owners are relieved of concerns about changes in regulations and having to upgrade their equipment, just de-ballast the water for an agreed cost. The harbours will have a good return of investment and at the same time be able to control the quality of treatment in local waters. If there are changes in regulations that require an upgrade of the system, it is more economical to simply upgrade a few barges rather than upgrading all systems on every ship. The harbours will be responsible for having a backup system at the harbours anyway, so it makes sense to do the treatment on multiple ships with return on investment at the same time. 
Controlled by the staff on board, the supply boat will easily attach to the ship's side using electromagnets, and when connecting, a rubber blade inflates to seal this connection. The ship starts the deballasting and water runs into our UltraFlow filter system, a new and reliable filter designed with water jetback flushing, a filter that produces a remarkable small amount of wastewater as it has a concentrated water jet forcing the waste off the filter basket. This will keep the 40 micron Stanley steel mesh filter constantly clean. The sludge is forced into a depot tank, while the clean water will run through the SafeRay UV system and straight into the sea. SafeRay is a powerful UV light system used to terminate organisms without using any chemicals. This is a very solid and proven method. Top Water Flow is using an automatic cleaning system for the UV light tubes. The UV light tubes are also mounted in a way that makes service and maintenance easy. Now, you may wonder where the waste from the filter is going. Our waste module processing facility makes the sludge into compost, which is rich in nutrients. This is a developed solution for this specific use, and it makes the waste useful instead of dumping it into the sea, as other ships do today. In this way, we take full advantage of all resources, making the return on investment even greater, in addition to being more environmentally friendly.